Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel for a new video. Lindsay, what are we doing today? We're doing something crazy that was thought up inside of your mind. Oh, I came up with this idea? <laughs> it was your idea. You yelled to me. You're like, Lindsay, I have an idea. Oh, sick. The idea is this. Wyatt is going to play a sound, and I'm going to guess out of three options which one is making the sound. That's right. Now, for the sounds that we're going to be taking a look at, I tried to group everything phonically best I could that made sense. So like kick drums, sounds are also located with things that could be along those lines, like a timpani or something like that. Same with cymbals. So there's some cymbal options that are grouped together. Everything we're going to be taking a look at is in one form or another, a percussion instrument. Not all of them are at the drum set, but they're all percussion instruments in one way or another. Interesting. Without further ado, should we start listening to some noises? Yes, play me some sounds. So any ideas out the gate? No idea. It's a symbol. It is a symbol. I will confirm it that. It is a I'll give you symbol. three options. Are you ready? Option A, 14 inch hi-hat. Option B, a 12 by 16 inch stack. And then option C, a 10 inch spiral stacker. The spiral thing is insane. It's literally cut into a spiral. And, so it, and it literally does fall apart. Like it goes apart like this. I was going to ask. You can okay. play this effects symbol in many different ways. There's guys that have like symbol stands where the, symbol, the effects symbol starts up top. And then there's a second layer of symbol where there's a symbol base and then this guy on top of that and it starts to coil up on the other symbol. Dude, this is a sandwich, not a stack. Yeah. That is so many layers. <laughs> so many layers of symbol. Okay, I don't think it's the hi-hat because I just think I would know, but I could be wrong. I don't think it's the hi-hat and I don't think it's the spiral because I feel like the spiral would be clanging around a lot more because there's like pieces of it, like different levels. So I feel like it would be sounding more like tinkly. Does okay. that make sense? All right, tinkly. Okay, so tinkly, tinkly. <laughs> because of that, I think it's the stack. Ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. You are. Yeah. Correct. Oh my gosh! Yes, 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 yes! I love getting the first one right. I've been really stressed about this game. Like, really stressed because I, like, my ear is like a kindergartner. Let's move along. We got <laughs> okay. the first one right. What are we, what's up next, Lindsay? First, let's listen to this sound. I am so excited for you to hear this one. <laughs> Definitely bongos. <laughs> is that your final answer? No, 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 no. Yeah, don't jump. I don't anything. lock anything in. No, don't lock anything. We haven't even viewed what the <laughs> options are. Okay, all right. Hit me with the options. Hit me with the options. So option A is is it a set of congas. Option B is a darbuka. All right. And option C is a pair of bongos. Is a pair of bongos. Okay, looking at the first image, I would have thought that that was also bongos. Those are pretty big. Just like XL bongos. Bongos have to be small. Yeah, more or less. Like bongos <laughs> okay. are small. They're like a lap. They're a it's lap. Like a lap party. A lap like instrument. A, like picture Diddy Kong, right? Or is it Donkey? <laughs> is it Diddy? I don't Who, remember. Which one plays the bongos? I don't remember. But I, I was. Diddy's got I call the bongos, you right? Donkey Kong because of that. I thought you called me Donkey Kong because I like with the big hits and everything. No, yeah, yeah, you're right. Yeah. So what, are, right, you, what are you doing? I don't know. So then I think it's Diddy that plays bongo. <laughs> what you think? What you think, girl? Wyatt has already seen me get excited over bongos. So does he choose bongos because of that? Or does he not choose bongos because of that? The first game we did the price guessing and you freaked out at bongos. I was very, I was just, I didn't expect it to you be there. You freaked out at bongos. I forgot bongos were drums. I taught you drum lessons and you yeah. were bringing up bongos again. I was, I was. So today when I was putting this together, I'm not going to not include bongos. You got to include it. <laughs> Number two. Let's go. This one I actually don't. I have no idea. Do you want to listen again? Uh, Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's hear it again, actually. Let's hear it again. <laughs> I think it's not the Darbuka. It sounded like there was two. Boom. Boom, look at that. Okay, so do you pick the bongos because I love the bongos or do you not pick them? Is the question. Tabongo or not tabongo? Oh man, even looking at these right now, I have no idea how different they would sound from each other. I think 50-50 shot. I think it's the conga. Wow. <gasps> is it the conga? Yes, it You're is. You're joking. Yes, it's uh, the conga. <laughs> I, oh my God. Dude. That you're was, off to a good start. That was literally anybody's game. Oh my God. Well, you took that one home, dude. Thank you. All right, scroll on down. Let's check out the All next right. sound. A lot of crap. What? That was it? That was all I got? That's all you got. Do you want to hear it again? Yeah, one more time. One more time. One more time. Okay, option okay. A is a UFO gong drum. Option B is a timpani. And option C is a bass drum. Pardon? <laughs> What's the middle one? Uh, well, how do I def describe a timpani? It Does it sound like the clip you just played? And all how close? three of them do. Okay. <laughs> Bite me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, go on. <laughs> okay, all right. UFO gong 
drum. Yes, ma'am. I thought a gong was one of those jumbo symbols that they hit in. That so is it's a, a gong. gong drum. This is a gong UFO gong drum. <sighs> oh my god, bottom... I literally don't know. I honestly have no idea. Like the other ones, I like had a little bit of a reason as to what I chose. Literally, the only thing that has me thinking is that there's a crowd, so I'm like, maybe it's just a kick drum. Someone's just kicking the kick drum, getting them fired up. I don't know. Obviously, these were recorded purposefully, though, so. What? Well, I mean, like, it obviously wasn't like a clip from like a live show. They did it on purpose for the website, no? Oh, like this. No, not all of these are from websites. <gasps> that was a literal live performance on YouTube that I took it from. Oh my God, it's the bass drum then. I think it's the bass drum. Nope. No. What is it? What, oh, what is that it? Clip, I hit the mic, I was so excited. That clip was yeah. taken from a timpani solo during a queen set. Literally what? Exactly, dude. <laughs> That's what's up. A timpani solo. There's a pedal on it. Is that a pedal? Press that pedal down. It actually pulls all of the lugs simultaneously down and increases the pitch. So oh. when you uh, when you play timpanis, you can like tune all the timpanis because these this is like an actual instrument that is pitched. Okay. So you tune them into the key of whatever you're playing in. And you can tune them and like do kind of cool stuff where you like actually press the pedal and like no you know? yeah. way like i don't think i don't i can't think of that's an actual musical sick. application there but that's what i spent a lot of time doing on my lunches in high school they had one at your high school they had two of these these they are also two? played in a set do you see, play that's, these? that's something i did to trip you up was you Aww. never see timpanis by themselves so i found a picture of a single timpani and yeah. i played a clip where he was only on the one timpani right oh. in that clip yeah. right where i cut it off yeah he goes to hit the other timpani oh my god so you, it would have given it away if i had two Let's move right along. Are you prepared for the next sound? Honestly, no. <laughs> we got number four. We're on number four. Here we go. Okay. All right. Let me focus. Want to hear it again? I don't know. I didn't like it. Okay, but yeah, yeah. Let me hear it again just for the game. This is like an old car. <laughs> Okay. No offense to the maker of this musical instrument. It's a percussion instrument. Half <laughs> these were just stumbled upon. Hey, bang that together. That sounds all right. True. <laughs> Yo, hit this with a stick. I bet it'll sound good. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So your options are option yes. A, rain stick. Oh, like from kindergarten. Okay. Option B, a Kokiriko. Mm, yes. And <laughs> <laughs> the off to disgust. And then option C yep. is a vibra slap. What? Minel has it listed here as the roar, but that's a vibra slap. The roar. It doesn't look like it at all, but it reminds me of one of those birds that like goes down to the water and goes, you know, you know what I mean? A it's lot like, of birds that dip their face a, in the no, water. No, like a like a mechanical little thing. Oh, one of those like guys. A garden thing. Yeah, it like tilts like this and it goes into the water and it comes back up. Do you know what I'm talking oh, about? Oh, like lawn decoration. Not even lawn decoration. I think it's like an indoor decoration. Man, what you dude. Think? Man, dude. Okay, literally even looking. Man, at dude. Man, dude. Man, dude. <laughs> Just dude, okay. Dude, man. <laughs> Dude, man. Just looking at the roar. I don't even know how it could make sound. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Like, I don't even know how you make sound from that. You hold it by the thing at the back. You turn it upside oh, down from where it is. And then you take that ball and you hit the ball into your hand or your leg. Oh. Then the device on top, because yeah. of the ball shaking, the device on top has shakers inside and it shakes. Oh, yeah. that makes so much sense. I've seen those just like a wooden paddle with like layers of paddle and you like hit it. Nope, not the same thing. That's okay. a completely different issue. Okay, never mind then. Moving on. And then we have Kokiriko. So this one's really easy to imagine. See how there's like a bunch of like wooden slots? Yes. So imagine like a line of dominoes with a string attaching all the dominoes and then two handles on each end. So you can bend it and create sound like a bunch of dominoes. You can go like really fast, like shh, or you can like shh. Whoa. Two of them are really weird. I knew they were going to trip you up. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> I have no idea. Okay. This um, one at the bottom, yeah, the we roar. had one both in my elementary school when yep. I was doing like grade four music or whatever. And then in high school, we had this part of the percussion stuff again. So I have wasted a lot of time slapping that thing. What, uh, um, what, what do we think, Lizzie? I don't think it's the roar. Because just to me, it sounded more natural like wood. All three of them are wood. Is this ball wood? Yes. Okay. I don't think it's the roar still for some reason. I just can't imagine it sounding like that after the way you described it. I want to say rain stick but maybe that's too obvious because like i feel like everyone actually knows what a rain stick is i don't know do you guys know what rain sticks are i feel like i had like my teacher had one in kindergarten um okay What's rain stick rain be? stick final rain answer rain stick final answer rain stick final answer wrong what was it the roar it was not yes, it was. i was so fast to discredit to the know. roar i know do you want to listen to it again it's not roaring in all fairness i know okay hit me Damn. You said it's the rain stick. The thing about yeah. it that's a dead giveaway, it's not the rain stick, is the rain stick, it's a lot longer. What Keeps if it was going. a baby rain stick? Oh, it could be. It could be. That's true. 
Because the rain sticks come in all sizes. That's yeah, it could totally just true. be like like this high, just like yeah. a little. Moving right along. All right, let's ready do it. check out the next guy. I am so ready. Moving on from the roar, we're coming up on number five. Here we go. Oh, okay. Want me to play that one more time? Yeah, That's one more time. Quick. Hit me. Hit me with my options, good sir. Option A, cowbell. Option B, a clave. Option C, woodblock. Uh, what, what is a clo clov clove deluxe? Those literally are just wood sticks. You just hit them together? So this cowbell is made of metal and the other two things are wood. Yeah. I think it's the cowbell. You think it's the cowbell? I do. The woodblock. Ah. I thought you put the cowbell in because it was the only metal one and it was supposed to like trip me up and make me think it wasn't the cowbell. No. You know what I'm saying? Just sound wise, woodblocks and cowbells are kind of in the same ballpark. Okay, okay. Yeah. I also thought it didn't necessarily stay on that wooden. True. Play it again, Wanna play it again, again actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, one, more time. Do it one more time. One more time. Oh no, yeah, it's pretty wood. <laughs> oh jeez. Okay, number how many have I got right so far? Just two? Uh, I'm not sure. All right, you ready for number six? I'm ready. Here we go. All right. Option A is 14 inch trash crash. Option B is 12 inch trash china. Option C is 16 inch dual china. These are all minor symbols. I don't know what else to say about them. They're also close together. What are you doing? Like the thing about the symbols is like the first set yeah. of symbols yeah. was we had a stack, yeah. we had a hi hat, yeah. and we had a stacker. They're also right? different. No, I, but it, at the end of the day, all of them are more yeah. than one symbol. Oh. You see what I'm saying? Yes. Like technically the stacker isn't, but it's kind of like in this weird place where you can stacks on itself sort of depending on how you set yeah. it up. Yeah, okay. So all three of those are like layers of metal yes. right this guy i went with the theme of just like trashy there's a big difference between a 16 inch symbol yeah and a 12 inch symbol with vent certainly there is and i don't know it it's pitch i feel like big is lower exactly big's lower okay okay wait play one more time play one more time because the bass drum is the biggest yeah oh yeah yeah in the guitar string it, that's the fattest is the lowest okay i think it sounds crashy okay so i'm gonna go with the dark trash crash you are wrong which one Maybe is I it i did make this too hard it's the pure Maybe. alloy it's the middle what it's the 12 inch trash china how could i really actually have known that we're just guessing out here bro <laughs> this one i think was the hardest so far <laughs> yeah really <laughs> really yeah at the beginning i said symbols Dude, were easy i put a couple then... things in that i didn't even, you didn't even know what they were like, yeah what's a slapper yeah yeah, I don't know. I okay, don't know. go ahead. Though I cut you off. Maybe they're what, all equal. Why is this hard. one the hardest? Because they're very similar to each other. The grand finale. What's up? This one's definitely a little bit different because we're not going to be picking an instrument. She already knows that it is a drum set. We're going to be listening to a whole drum set, cymbals, okay. everything. Cymbals too? Yeah, full player just going to town on his kit. Okay? Oh God. Okay. Now the thing we're going to be guessing here is if it's made out of acrylic, steel, or wood. Acrylic, steel, or wood. And I feel like for you, this is just going to be 33% chance. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. For anybody calling us out on this is too hard. Yes. This was your idea. You're right. This was my idea. Yeah. yeah because dude. I was trying to think of like things that are same but different. And, and this, this is, is kind of cool. I like this idea. I liked it a lot. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. No. Can I ask okay, you a question? Okay, okay. Did Questions. you get the drum sounds from a song or from like a person that you know who plays the kits? Or is this like the official sound on the website of each kit? This is a live performance on YouTube. Oh. So like it's a drummer in a studio playing the kit. There's no music on top of it. There's no audience. Okay. They just hear the drums. Guy going to town. You guys at home, what do you think? I know, right? Before she guesses it, comment and then let's see if you get it right. I don't think it's metal already just because that seems like it didn't sound so intense. And I feel like hitting metal would sound like really like, like really intense, really crashy. I feel like that just sounds like normal drums. I think that it is acrylic just because it sounds very like bouncy, I guess. I don't know why. I just think it's acrylic. It's just wood drums. Ah, oh, dude. I literally thought because you had that reaction, it was going to be right. No, dude. Well, two out of seven is not bad. Damn. Two out of seven. All right. I don't know. We'll have to yeah. mix it up next time. Yeah, I have to make it. We'll flip it around. You can you can do this to me, but we'll be more yeah. specific, maybe. Yeah, like highly specific. Like which brand? Like symbol lines. Yeah, dude. All right, guys. So there you have it. We really hope that you guys enjoyed this video at home. If you did, make sure to let us know by hitting the like button. You can support this channel at the Patreon and the merch link in the description below. You can connect with us further at our social media links. They're on the screen for you right now and in the description below. If you guys have ideas for future games that we can play, let us know in the comments below and maybe we can make one of your ideas happen. Thanks so much for checking out this video and we will see you guys all very soon with something new.